hello guys so this is going to be our last video for the first project that we decided to launch and to host our first portfolio or cv online all free of cost all together and at the end of this video we will be having our own personal cv on the net and you will be getting a link for that and I would like to request each one of you, whoever complete the project for the CV, kindly share your link in the comment section below so that I can see, and not even me, we each of us can see each other's CV. And obviously you can, you may, if you want, you can just hide your contact details or you can just do something, whatever you feel like, comfortable if you are but i would like to request you all to share that link so that we may encourage others to we can learn from each other and there might be some cv that will be better than others so that we can ask the one or can do something better with ours too or we can even get hints or guidance from the one so i hope that you will cooperate you will you have enjoyed this journey up till now and next time we will be upcoming with something more advanced, more challenging, more with fun. So let's get dive into this final step of our first project. So as I promised you that we won't be using any of the paid things. So how can we upload without any money? So the easy solution is to go to the GitHub, sign up. If you don't have an account, if you have an account, just sign in and then just click over here then we are going for repositories plus new repository here you will type cv cv1 for example then public then you will choose Add a readme file, then create repository. Here we are. So now what you will do, you just add file, upload files. So where are we going to go now? We will be moving to our website here here now we will copy and paste each and everything here oh my god i'm sorry so here we will do something again just drag and drop There you go. So now you will click commit changes. Obviously you will write a name. I will write personal first CV and then yes. Continue. It will take a little bit of time. There you are. What you will do next is go to the settings. Come on now, where are the pages? Yes, go to the pages. None. Main. So here we are. So as you, this screen will appear, what you will do next is click on the save button. And there you are, you have got this link. This is your own link. It might take some time to load, but just try it after 15 to 20 minutes. If it doesn't load once, try it after 15 to 20 minutes. 
and you will observe something that you have created on your own first ever time in sorry but this is what i created now i believe that you would have created much more better than mine so this is how we work and congratulations this was our first huge task in which you used html and there was nothing there was no element of css or javascript and you were mostly you were totally a beginner but you did it congratulations and you might brag now you might share and what i'll be saying now is that it's that if you get value feel free to ask question if there are any type of question i'm thinking of making a facebook group too so that we can discuss easily over there it might get difficult for the people to communicate on youtube but obviously comments are always welcome i'll be waiting for your feedback if you get value just stay tuned like share and subscribe and we will be learning along this journey i'm sorry for my teaching style it will improve time by time and we will have a great journey together see you soon take care thank you bye bye